yo, what's trapping, guys? What's trapping? I don't know what this is. Sorry, I'm gonna stop that right now before it gets cringy. Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to another video, and today this is another episode of Cow Moss. If you are wondering what Cow Moss means, it means chill out with me on Saturday. That's right, guys, as you know, and I keep saying this in every single Saturday video that Saturday is a pretty busy day for me, so I can't post on Saturdays like a regular video, but they're just going to be like chill out hangout videos where we can just talk about things. And uh, I really wanted to just say something for this video is that I freaking love you guys. Like I am literally in love with you guys. Will you marry me? I'm serious. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But I am uh, really, really thankful to have you guys here with me. You know, I noticed something the other day that every single video I've posted these last few weeks has hit over like almost some of them even have 2000 comments and hundreds of likes and thousands of views and you know what it really means a lot to me because like i've said many times i was starting to get what they call youtube burnout and that's when a youtuber posts for so long and so consistently and i did that for so many years like i've been on youtube for eight years guys and i've tried every different thing that you can possibly try i've done challenges i've done horror videos i've done calling creepy numbers i've done ouija boards i've done ghost videos i've done i've done a whole bunch of different things and uh, i also did like way back in the day i did things on dylan the hacker and like that was another youtube war that i was in back then and somehow i've just got in a big circle in a way and came back to my roots. I'm still doing wars, which is crazy, but it is fun. And uh, that's the main thing that I want to put out here is that, you know, YouTube was, uh, it, it turns to something that I actually hated. And when I first started YouTube, my whole intention was to grow. I wanted to grow a fan base. I wanted to grow a huge audience as big as I could possibly get it. And uh, that's because I always wanted to be an actor since I was about seven or eight years old. And it's just impossible to get into the acting industry. So I really had to think to myself, what am I going to do? You know, I need to do something where I can actually be happy and something that I'm passionate about. Um, and I never let that go. It wasn't just a phase. I always wanted to do this, but I couldn't figure out how to get myself in there. You know, how do you get yourself in? I, I'd always been to drama schools and acting classes and stuff like that. And I never got anywhere. And you know, it, it is a big dream to have. Everybody wants to freaking be an actor and stuff like that. So th there's a limited few people that actually get selected for that. And uh, I don't know what it is. I may not be the greatest actor, but I love to entertain people. It brings me happiness. It brings me like, that's my passion is to entertain people. And well, when I figured that you can actually get paid on YouTube, I was like, whoa, I'm in, I can do this, I can do this, I can buy a camera, I can get lighting and equipment, and I can start my own YouTube channel, I could do this. So I don't have to worry about like agencies anymore or anything like that, or auditions or anything like that. I can just, I can act and do whatever I want from the comfort of my own home. And that was way back in 2012. And you know what? A lot has changed in my life since then. I've been up, I've been down. I've had the best time of my life on this channel. I've also had the worst time of my life on this channel. Like this channel is literally my life. And I've met a whole bunch of people. Some people come, some people go. New people come, they stay, they, they go. And uh, one thing that really means a lot to me is you guys who have come here and also you horror fans who stuck with me for so many years and you are still here right now. Like I, I can think of a couple, um, like but there's so many, I can't really, I mean, there's Marla, Marla for a start. Thank you, Marla. You are a loyal fan. You've been here for a long, long time, way before the scammer videos. And the same with Maddie, um, you know who you are. It really means a lot to me to see you guys still here. There's a lot of the horror fans that I haven't seen them in months since I've been doing the scammer videos. And that's okay. I'm not like throwing shade at those people, you know, saying like they're not true fans. If you're not into this a certain type of content, you don't have to watch it, you know? I mean, that's the whole point of YouTube. Like I don't watch, I might watch like uh, videos of people that I enjoy, like they're my favorite YouTuber, but I don't watch every single video they make because there might be something that they do in videos that I don't like. Um, and it's just not my, my taste, you know? So that's okay. It's fine to not watch like every single video. Um, but what I always wanted was to just have an audience who was here and loyal. And I didn't really want fans per se. I, I actually wanted like friendship in a way like in a weird way i wanted to kind of connect with you guys as like like we're friends and uh that's kind of what i always wanted i don't know whether it's like i mean i am a pretty lonely person in real life so i i really love youtube because it's a place where i can 
engage with you guys and you know we're all replying in the comments and uh it's a it's an amazing feeling to me and it's just something that i've always wanted and my channel is actually growing again and uh, i just want to thank you guys a lot i mean i've posted some videos as a test um to see if you guys would stick around or not like that cat video and stuff like that and you guys are still showing up even for the videos that are not about scammers which means a lot to me um and so i just really want to thank you for that like I love you guys, I actually do. You're a big part of my life. And this channel has everything that I've ever really done in a creative way, it has on this channel. I have over a thousand videos on this channel. Um, and I'm just gonna keep going for as long as I can. I don't plan on ever quitting YouTube, but I was getting, uh, before I started doing the scammer videos, you know, in fact, go back to New Year's. New Year's 2019, I told myself and I told this channel that I'm going to post every single day. That is my New Year's resolution. I don't care if I'm sick. I don't care what's going on. I will sacrifice anything to post videos every day. This is the year that I want to make happen for me again. I want to get back to where I used to be on YouTube. And so I did that and I've successfully done it up until now. Um, I'm actually on like four months right now. I've done over four months of every single day, which is insane. I this is the longest I've done this in three years, but I really am motivated But I'll be honest when I started I started doing the scary videos again And I knew I wasn't ready to throw myself back into that But I tried to mentally convince myself that I I am a horror youtuber I can do this and I was getting the burnout again And that's what happens to me when I keep doing these horror videos and they don't grow, they don't get any engagement, and you know, they don't get any views or anything like that. It's just a dead channel, which is demotivating anyway. Only a handful of people show up to comment. And um, yeah, it was just, it was killing me. I just forced myself to make these videos. I wasn't even into making them. Like I didn't even enjoy making them. It sucked for me, but I did it anyway. And I noticed that I was quickly starting to burn out again, like less than a month, I was starting to burn out. Um, and that's when this whole scammer series took off and it's just blew up since then. Now we're here like three months later. I've been doing scam videos every single day for three months and I don't know how it's still going, but you guys still enjoy it. In fact, more and more people are showing up every day, thousands of comments every single day. So people are enjoying it and everybody's like, do another scam war, do another comment war. It's crazy like how this has become a thing and it feels so familiar to back when before I started doing the scary videos, it feels so familiar to them because I was doing like comment wars back then too. And so I, I do feel like I've kind of gone back to where I started and now is my chance to, to start again and grow again and try different things. Now that I have like a, a whole bunch of new people here, it's my chance to start proving myself that I have potential and I know I do, um, not to suck my own willy or anything like that but <laughs> but i uh i believe that i have potential and i know how hard working and passionate and dedicated i am to this channel um and so you guys the fact that you guys are giving me that chance and you guys chose to subscribe and chose to turn on the notification bell um that really does mean a lot to me a lot more than you think i'm not just this guy who like just has a youtube channel for fun this is literally my life and I don't know where I would be without it. This has done so much good for my life. Um, and that's why I hate talking bad about YouTube. Like, oh, I hate YouTube like how I used to be because YouTube's, it's given me freedom that I never would have had if, you know, if I didn't have it. There's things that I've done in my life and that I could support myself because I was a YouTuber and I didn't have to like be at work the next day, you know? Um, so it's given me a lot more freedom but it's also given me a feeling of like fulfillment. It's a very rewarding thing to do is be a YouTuber and see that you're making people's lives happier and see comments every day saying, Mike, I was depressed, but then I came home and watched your video and you always make me laugh like that. To me, means a lot to me. And I know every YouTuber says that and most YouTubers are fake as fuck, but like I'm being serious. You can trust me. <laughs> I've always been like dead serious with you guys. Um, but it does mean a lot to me. And I think that's because I spent most of my years, uh, especially in my early 20s, late teens, early 20s, alone. And so I know how it feels to be alone and sit there in your house watching 
Uh, for me, it was like Roman Atwood's vlogs. They were motivating me. They were making me laugh. They were making me smile more. And Good Mythical Morning, Rhett and Link, always have me busting my ass laughing. Like it was, it felt like they were my friends in a way. And so I feel like that's why I have this connection to YouTubers and to, to being that way, you know? Because I know how it feels to be alone and sad and all that stuff. And when you watch your, your favorite YouTuber, it does motivate you, it does lift you up, it raises your spirits, and that's kind of what I want to do. I, I like to make people happy, and you guys, in return, are making me happy just by being here and showing your support and your loyalty, um, and so that means a lot to me, and I feel like this could really grow. If we keep up this love and this uh, relationship that we have, it could it could grow. The sky's not the limit. Like, who cares about the sky? Let's just go higher than the sky. Let's go to the clouds. But thank you for watching, guys. This is just a ramble video, and I'm going to do this every Saturday, so it's up to you if you want to tune in or not for another Calmus. And, uh, yeah, so that's what I'm going to call it from now on. Calmus. Calm, chill. What, you, what is it called again? <laughs> I forgot my own series. Chill out with me on Saturday, guys, and I love you all. Remember the most important thing, chase your dreams, and let me know in the comment section who is your favorite YouTuber, and don't just say me because you feel sorry for me. Like, I'm actually curious. Let me know in the comment section. Thank you for watching, guys. Hit the like button down below to show some support, and I'll see you back here in the next video. Peace out, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoy my videos and you would like to support me and my channel more and also be featured in my videos, go check out my Patreon. Link is in the description. I would really appreciate any help you guys have to offer. As you can see, we have different tiers, different rewards. So go over there, check it out. And uh, I would really appreciate that. Every little helps. Thank you so much. And also guys, don't forget to subscribe with the notification bell on and also follow me on all my social media. I have Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and even Snapchat. So go follow Follow me on all of those and remember the most important thing, I love you guys and chase your dreams.